Hi, I'm Madeline Shaw and welcome to my Eat Clean series with Scoff. Today we're going to be making a very delicious fish pie with cauliflower mash. Okay, your first step is you want to roughly chop up one cauliflower and then we're going to pop it in with two tablespoons of boiling water and we're just going to steam it for five minutes. So this is going to become your mash. So it's a slightly different take on a typical fish pie because we're going to use cauliflower as the mash. So you want to be able to just put your fork through, but we're going to cook it a bit more later so it doesn't have to be too sort of squidgy. So we're going to pop this into here. And then we're going to place one teaspoon of mustard in there to give it a little bit nice flavour. And then some coconut oil. So we're going to make this whole dish completely dairy free. So it's a slightly different change on your regular fish pie. And coconut oil is amazing for you. It's so good for your skin and you can cook with it. I also use it as like a moisturizer too. Um, and it's going to make it really nice and creamy. So we're going to blend this all up. So we're just going to pop this to the side and we're going to make the beautiful coconut sauce. First step, we're going to put a tablespoon of coconut oil into the pan. In with the spring onions, and this is going to be our base. So if you've forgotten any of the ingredients or the quantities or anything like that, you can check out the full recipe on the website. We're just going to fry this off for about three or four minutes, um, just to get it nice and soft. So we're going to put in a nice pinch of sea salt, 200 mils of coconut milk in there, and a bay leaf as well. A little bit of pepper. Give that a nice stir. It smells beautiful. And we'll just let that simmer nicely for about five minutes. Put some mustard in. So this series is all about classics that you love made healthy. So this is my healthy take on fish pie. We've gone, um, you know, dairy-free using coconut milk instead and obviously we've got the cauliflower mash which I'll show you how it all comes together in the end. We've got lots of fresh fish going in there which is so good for you, lots of omega-3 and then we've got obviously a bit of veg, we've got some peas going in and we've got some spinach as well. So we're going to pop that on top and just carefully place it in and the thing about spinach is it looks like there's a lot going on and then once we start steaming it it's going to it's going to get a lot smaller and then we're going to place the lid on. So we'll just leave that to wilt and cook and steam and all those beautiful juices just for a couple of minutes. I've used salmon and prawns in my fish pie but you can use all different types of fish so if you've got a favourite combination leave a comment below and let us know. So while the fish is steaming we're just going to put two egg yolks into the mash and then we're just going to grab a nice pinch of sea salt in there. We'll whisk that in. Okay, perfect. So, let's pop the fish into the base of our tin. So we just want to pour this out, get all the liquid as well. So you can see that those prawns have got nice and pink. And that salmon, look at it, it's nice, starting to flake. And then, we're going to put the mash on top. Here we have a nice creamy cauliflower mash. So we're just going to spread it on beautifully. Now I think the best thing to do for newbie health freaks like me <laughs> is tell them, don't tell them it's cauliflower and just let them see because often I find people still think it's your potato that they're having on top and it tastes just as good and you're getting more veggie goodness into you. So if you recreate this recipe, which I hope you do, please share it with me with my Instagram, which is Madeline underscore Shaw underscore, and obviously with Scoff as well, because we love seeing your recreations. So here you go, perfect pie ready for the oven. So we want to put it in 200 for 20 minutes until it's nice and bubbling and hot. While the pie is cooking in the oven, make sure you subscribe to Scoff's channel and my YouTube channel. And also I have a book coming out April 23rd, so make sure you pre-order on Amazon. So we're just going to grab the pie out of the oven and look at that. We're just That's exactly what we want, that nice golden brown on the top. Just a little bit of bubbling coming from the side. And yes, it's essential to have a matching oven glove to your outfit. 
So here you have it, a delicious healthy fish pie with cauliflower mash. I hope you enjoy it and I'll see you next week.